You are watching Endeavor TV and this is the Packard Bell Dot S2 netbook with a 10 inch uh, display and I'm going to show you now how to upgrade the RAM or your uh, hard drive and you have a little bit uh, surprise in here for you of course also. So if you just want to upgrade the RAM it, uh, it's pretty easy, Packard Bell didn't uh, made, a, made it too hard to get inside the box. So you just have to unscrew this one little screw if you want to upgrade the RAM and then you are ready to go. You can put a maximum um, 2 gigs of RAM, DDR2, SODIMM, doesn't matter if it's 800 MHz or 667 MHz, just make sure that it's DDR2 and SODIMM. So after you unscrew the screw, even if it won't come out, you can just lift this uh, up here. I have two uh, short um, fingernails, so I just take this card for that process and there you go. And you can already see we have the uh, RAM stick inside. If you want to take this out, you only have to push these little metal things to the side and then it pops already up and you can just take it out. There you can see we have the DDR2 Sodium RAM. It has Samsung chips and this is 1 gig and you can put in maximum 2. If you want to put it in again, make sure to have the short side on the left. Put it in um, all the way so you can see the uh, golden um, co um, connectors. And then just push it down and yeah there you go after that you can just put back on the lid and push it down to the bottom also till it fits and then just screw in back the screw i will do that later but now i'm going to show you how to take off the um, hard drive lid and show the little bit the little surprise so you have to unscrew all these three screws i already did that before I left them inside because they're kind of hard to get out and here you have to um, lift this end up again and after lifting it up, just give me one second, there you go, take that off and you can see we already have the hard drive here, the wireless and bluetooth card and another empty PCI Express slot so you can put in a Broadcom chip or a PCI Express a SSD, a really short one or whatever you want. So this is the inside. The hard drive is already unscrewed too after you take off the lid here because we unscrew these three screws here. So you can just uh, lift up the hard drive or lift it out like this. And there we go. We have a Hitachi 160 GB um, 5400 RPM hard drive manufactured in December 2009. It's of course SATA not Parallel ATA, but yeah, there we go. If you want to put it back in, just push it back in, and there we go. This wasn't so hard. So, this is the inside of the Packard Bell Dot S2. I will check if I, um, I want to disassemble it further, but I'm not sure because actually, you have everything right here RAM, hard drive, and PCI Express Cardio, so you don't have to. Uh, mess it up by unscrewing all the other screws. That's like two, four, six, eight, nine. You have to unscrew nine more screws if you want to take off the whole bottom, but what for? So, this was the Packard Bell Dot S2 netbook from Endeavor TV. This was Balaj Gal. And check out endeavor.com or Endeavor TV on YouTube for more information about this netbook and other netbooks. See ya.